so we did have the rest of the season planned and so we did have to cancel concerts but i have to give it to this team that we were super creative on how to continue we started videotaping faculty and students in the hall or from their home started looking for concerts that we have maybe had videotaped in the past so we did a little bit of historic concerts our mission our goal was to provide comfort to our community so it was really beyond just making music for the fun of it. It wasn't about entertainment or fun, even though, of course, this is what we love to do. It was about bringing comfort to our community. Yeah, I think it was also to kind of uh, inspire other people to see, hey, we don't have to stop. You know, we can still create things. We can still be creative. Um, and also that allowed people to connect with other people because we have resources and other people are putting stuff out that are not necessarily within the arts or arts background, you know? So we can easily access that that resource and use it to create what we normally do, you know, and just change it up a little bit. We've always had that connection with the community, but as Joseph said, because we didn't have any live events and the, the community couldn't interact with the artists after the concert or, or before the concert, we were able to pivot and utilize those social media outlets and provide content and that connection with the community, even though we weren't having any live events.